Hello everyone, welcome back to Gent Watches, and today we are continuing with Paripikome, your boy Kongming. This is going to be episode 6 today. Uh, before I get to the to, vi to the video, um, I just want to quickly say to people who are watching the uh, your boy Kongming videos, thank you for watching uh, all these videos. These videos have been uh, doing better than, than most of the other videos I've been doing. Uh, people really like your boy Kongming, and that's really awesome because I really like it as well. Um, and with this episode, we shall be caught up, I believe. I don't think episode 7's out yet, so we should be caught up with uh, by this episode, and so that means that it won't be every two days now. It will be going on to weekly as the show comes out, so when the episode comes out, hopefully on that day or the day after, I should be posting my reaction to it. So stay tuned for that. Make sure to subscribe so that you actually get that happening. Um, I also noticed in my analytics that um, I have, like, a, a decent, like, the highest proportion of my viewership it according to the youtube statistics are from japan which is very interesting to me because i did not expect that so i mean if you're from japan welcome and thanks for watching my videos i appreciate it um whether you're watching it because you understand english or whether you're watching it just for my facial reactions or whether you're watching it uh because you are using subtitles or something Whatever the case, thank you for joining me, and it's really great to have you. Um, so, we are going to be getting into episode 7, 6, 6, um, and last episode we got introduced to our new rapper friend, Kabe, and I'm really excited because he seems like a great character, and I want him to meet uh, Eiko, and uh, it, it's I think we're going to have like a rap battle in this episode, and I'm really excited for that. Like, I... I'm, I'm beaming, you can see how big I'm smiling because I'm genuinely really excited for any sort of rap battle stuff that might be happening here, so... Oh man, I'm, I'm, I'm keen, I'm keen. So, without further ado, I think we're just gonna jump right into it, here we go! Oh, they're gonna be comparing rap to poetry, which is very nice. That's so cool. In the past, they try to get get a poet. In the future, they try to get a rapper. That's great. Ban, oh, chicky, chicky, chan, chan. Oh, chicky, chicky, ban, ban. Oh, chicky, chicky, chick, chick, bang, ban. So good. So good. Kong Ming's freestyle. Yay, go! Singing in Japanese. What about it? What? Oh. I assume it's not Eiko's song, it's just she's doing a cover of it. But, awesome. Don't be making fun of him. Don't be making fun of him. Please, don't be making fun of him. She's sitting on her lap. Aww. Oh, they're doing it like comments on a screen, right? In Japanese YouTube stuff. Not YouTube, but. Oh, okay. So they they were being genuine, but. <laughs> Right. That actually makes a lot of sense why he would become a rapper then. That's a cool shot. This show is surprisingly creative, even though it doesn't look incredibly high budget. They... They work really well with what they have. Red Horse. Oh! Sekitoba Kung Fu album. Oh, Look at him! Aww. Being inspired by her, yes! Oh no, they've, they've just, oh, they've already dragged him into it. Sorry about the barking dogs. Ignore them. <laughs> Why get the, she needs her lung capacity. 
Oh my gosh, this is so interesting. Oh! He's prodding him. <laughs> yes! Whoa! Oh my god, they're not even using the stage? Just locally. Just by crowd hype, right? Yeah. <laughs> I like how he speaks and rhymes. Here we go. Three rounds. Okay. Awesome. <laughs> He's doing calm fantasy version. Very nice. Oh man, I love Kabe's rapping style though. <laughs> Getting the crowd in. Yes! Whoa! Ooh. Ooh. That flow was great! Oh! That's a great flow! Holy crap! That was an awesome flow! <laughs> Whoa! Oh. Oh. oh, listen to that flow! <laughs> Whoa! That's so cool. <laughs> I don't even know. That was very close. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. This is the best episode. This is so good. Oh my gosh. This is one of the best rap battles I've seen in anime. I'm actually genuinely liking this more than any of the ones in Hypnosis Mike, and that's a rap anime. Drop the beat! Look how focused he is. <laughs> oh. <laughs> 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 
さに己を知らぬ馬食とあなた馬食はきっと私が指示したその悲しみがあなたにわかるか壁は逃げた自分に Oh my gosh This is a real battle He's actually Oh this is actually an attack Oh my gosh. Oh, pretty good rebuttals from both of them. Oh, do it a cappella. Nighty just doing a poem. Dang, Seki Tobe is on it. <laughs> Look at Aiko's face. This isn't part of the poem anymore, right? Oh. <laughs> Woo. Whoa! Wow! To change someone's mind and heart in the middle of a rap battle. Yeah, Kabe wins. Yeah. Oh man. さすがにすぐるわ。負けてくれないかな。わかりました。え、1億円お支払いします。あ、ごめん。待った、待った。え、言っては見たけど、やっぱ違うわ。俺の。That's <laughs> もう叶えてもらったよ。ラップを始めた頃の熱い気持ちを。だからもういいんだ。欲しいものはもう手に入った。これは一本取られましたね。一人の男がいた。栄子のファン一号。オッケー、ディスガイ。名もなきその男は知
and I can see how Kong Ming has not done rap before, but Kong Ming was basically just doing poetry. Um, with that being said, the way he was switching up his flow was, I'm pretty sure that's pretty advanced stuff, so, uh, but he, he was, he was just basically doing poetry, which he probably knows very well, and Kabe was doing traditional rap battle rapping, and it was so, it was so great to see those two styles clash, because I think, like, generally, I think Kabe's, um, Kabe's bars hit harder for the most part from what I was reading it was going pretty fast and I'm I'm also when I was watching it I'm trying to listen to the Japanese and see how the rhyme schemes are crafted because that's like a very interesting and important part of it so since I'm doing that and I'm watching the animation and watching the subtitles I'm I'm missing I'm always missing stuff so I that's just the unfortunate thing about watching something in Japanese with subtitles, especially when it's something that's complex like l lyrics. Um, and the other bit that's kind of a shame is like the lyric, the people who are writing the subtitles are obviously trying to write it with rhymes as well to match the th stuff, but then writing them in rhymes, having to write it what they say in a way that shows their intent, but also rhymes. It's got to be extraordinarily difficult. And I think in that, because of that, some of the more complex rhymes are going to become much simpler in the subtitles. So I actually won't see how complex the rhymes are or how complex the wordplay is and stuff like that because the subtitles are doing their best and you can't blame them for that. Um, so I'm sure there's so much stuff that's going to get lost in it. But from what I was reading and seeing and hearing... Kabe's bars seem to hit harder and be more, like, more rap battle-y, you know? Um, they had more of a punch to them and he had a, 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 a good theme going on. When Kong Ming's goal was to get Kabe to feel in like he enjoyed rap again so that he would want to join them. And so Kong Ming, his bars, I mean, he had a few bars that hit pretty hard, but for the most part, his bars weren't hitting as hard. But his rap technique was surprisingly great. And his and as I said, his flow was so good. Some of his flow switches were amazing. They were so good. And it was just really fun to listen to. I enjoyed that so much. Um It's nice that Echo singing is still inspiring people. And this time though, like if I understood that scene correctly, this time it was like set up to inspire because they did reconnaissance on him and chose the perfect time and song and whatever to do it and uh and on top of that um Kabe was sort of led to believe that he had gotten over his stomach troubles uh out of nervousness which means he must have been having fun and stuff but really Kong Ming was just giving him medicine <laughs> Which is really funny because it's like, because it's, it, it's good because like once he thinks he doesn't have those troubles with nerves anymore, then he probably won't have troubles with nerves anymore. But it's also kind of underhanded because it's getting him on false pretenses. They're getting him up on stage and then being like, see, you were fine all along. But then he was actually, it's like if in Space Jam, you know, in Space Jam, the, the, um, the scene where they give the, you know, Michael Jordan special water or whatever, special sports drink, and then they all drink it and they all become amazing players. And then later they're like, um, it's just water. Um, and that, and so it's like, no, it was, it was inside you all along. You, you had that, you had the, uh, you had the skills with you all along. It's like if he was like, oh no, it's just water. But then it was actually steroids. You know, that's, actually, that's sort of what it feels like. But anyway. Great episode. I'm so happy. It is kind of funny that Kong Ming has underhanded tactics like that, where they're like, they're not morally wrong necessarily, but they're they're a little dirty. He's playing a little dirty all the time, but that's what you would think a war tactician would do. So, wow, great, great. I think uh, there's not much else for me to say, and if there is, I'll just be going in circles. So uh, let's let's just be happy with what I've said about it and. Uh, end it there so 
Um, so guys, if you're still watching this video, please make sure to subscribe to the channel and like the video. All of this stuff will really help me out and will just be great for the channel, for the channel's longevity, for the channel's growth. Um, and for me to do more of these sorts of videos, the more attention these videos get, the easier it is for me to do the videos, make time for them, etc, etc. So please help me out on that front. Um, keep the comments coming. I'm loving the comments on the Kong Wing videos. They are very, uh, very interesting and you guys are engaging a lot with it and it's great. It's awesome to, uh, to read. So, uh, keep those comments coming. I'll keep reading them. And uh, like the video, and that's about it. So thanks for watching this episode, and I will see you when Kongming episode 7 comes out. So goodbye.